Meanwhile, Gordon House descended into a shouting match on Tuesday as both sides of the House argued about the government's proposed minimum wage offer. However, things got heated when controversial member of Parliament for St. St. Catherine's Southwest, Erval Warmington, referred to Youth and Culture Minister Lisa Hanna as a Jezebel. The copy that I got from him, it said, Mr. Speaker, it is indeed a pleasure for me to be afforded. It says a pleasure for me. He said, he oh, yeah. Deputy Speaker of the House, Mr. Lloyd B. Smith, called on Mr. Warmington to withdraw his comments. Mr. Warmington. Mr. Speaker, it really is unfortunate. Um, you, did, you, you called a member of this House, Jezebel. I'm asking that you retract. That. Mr. Speaker, I withdraw that word, but allow me to read the sentence. Yeah. The, the, the statement is here, and everybody can read it. But in council, the member of this lady also when it's here. If this continues, I am going to adjourn the House. Government member Luther Buchanan described Mr. Warmington as obnoxious. Mr. Speaker, it is of paramount importance that the member shows respect for the office of the Speaker and for his colleagues and for the hallowed halls of this Parliament. Too often, Mr. Speaker, that member is, is, is rude and obnoxious in this House. into disrepute and I am saying it is time that something be done about that member. Meanwhile, Ms. Hannah took to Twitter on Wednesday calling for disciplinary sanctions against Mr. Warmington. In her post, Ms. Hannah said, Mr. Warmington is misogistic and obnoxious. She said, quote, much as I would prefer to be surprised at such grossly unparliamentary behavior by a colleague, I am forced to confess that Mr. Warmington's misconduct is no surprise. Based on his history, he seems to have a problem with women in general and an obsessive compulsion with me, end quote.